Hello, my dear soul. Welcome to a new reading. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, my air signs. Welcome to your reading. What you need to hear right in this moment, right now. We are going to ask the cards about something that is going on in your life right now and what you need to know about this situation, what you should do about it and we try to find out, um, to take a look at the future if you follow the advice. So this is your current situation, something that is uh, happening in your life right now and let's find out what is important for you to know. Um, I will also take the tarot and all the other cards, but let me just turn this before I pull the rest of your cards. Now, patience. Patience, be careful with who you talk, what you say, uh, paperwork. Everything will, will be all right. Everything will work in your favor. But there is this need of patience. We will see. Let me pull your cards. And then we are going to uh, really look uh, deep into your reading and find out um, what is the most important thing for you right now uh, let me take from this deck also two cards for you here bear with me for a second one two okay so let's see what is all about here with you. So first of all, um, there is some sort of confusion here because you have the two of swords. Maybe there is an opportunity at hand here and you're like, should I take, should I take this? or not what will bring me how things will be for me maybe there is a person here coming in with a, with an offer for you and this is a solid op opportunity here uh, it's something that uh, uh, it's maybe for a long term maybe there is a job opportunity a collaboration here but you are very indecisive you don't know what to do Look at this two of swords with two of swords. Your indecision is holding you back here. So the, the reason that you might uh, have a hard time deciding what to do next is because you are maybe putting um, on the first place here what others will think, how others will be affected by your your decision and so on you know so uh your uh first piece of advice that is coming up very very clear is that to to stop trying to please others and just follow your dreams and just uh, do something that will be good for you that will change your life that will make you feel happy and good you cannot please everyone and now it's a situation where your happiness depends on um, so taking in consideration what your family will think your friends or the whole world is a bad bad approach you are being advised here to um, to you know just a moment Wow, <laughs> the clover to take the opportunity and to also um, know that look, good luck, joy, and prosperity. This is a great opportunity for you to bring a fresh new wind over your life and uh, do not let uh, other people to to influence you or to stop you from from taking this. Uh, um, 
this decision or this new path in your life uh, you have the wolf here showing me that um, as, as, as you make this change, as you go to this with this offer, you will see who is your true friend, who is your uh, true supporter and who isn't. All right. Um, and um, definitely here, um, you might have to let certain people or situations behind you as you step into this new uh, phase in your life. Um, but this is life. You, you cannot take everyone with you. Can I take everything with you? There are uh, always uh, people in our lives that will agree with us and people that uh, will just not get what we try to do, where we are going. And that's all right. The most important thing, my dear, is that you are the one who is living the consequences of your actions, of your choices, right? So if this feels right for you, go along with it and... Um, and don't uh, waste this opportunity because because of what others will uh, think or or uh, or do or whatever. Uh, you, the important is if it makes sense for you, go along with it. All right. Now, um, what I get here for you is that um, you don't worry. You should not worry. All right. As I said, everything will work in your favor. And uh, we see also here with the world card that uh, a difficult chapter is coming to an end, has been a long way. And finally, you are getting to the end of it. There is an accomplishment or a celebration, um, a big change in your life. What is interesting is that... Um, all your hard work, all the hardship that you went through, it will, uh, you know, <laughs> put you in the spotlight. You will be a winner. You will come out a winner out of this situation. You have the chariot here and look at this. Success that comes from dedication and self-discipline, celebrating your accomplishments, being in the spotlight. So as small... Um, as you may feel right now, as uh, big you will feel in the future, you will see how everything will change for you. Now you have here um, the awakening. The awakening is the actually the hangman, right? Telling you to change the way you are looking at the situation, embrace your uniqueness, and um, how important it is to take a break, right? Why? Because uh, before you before you decide which path to go, take a break and analyze. But the analyze that you have to make, make it from uh, the, this point of view, what feels right for you, what you truly want. And do not involve into this decision what other people want, what your family wants. Make sure that this decision is made um, from your soul, um, with all your heart and mind, and there is no other influence, okay? Now, definitely, the herald of change here shows that it's, it's time for action, it's time for a change, a necessary transition, right, to get out of your mind and to, to make a firm decision for your future here. And of course, we have the ship, which is showing us um, uh, you moving on, uh, starting a new adventure, a new journey, can be literally traveling, or if not, a change of ways, a uh, change of career. This opportunity with the Ace of Pentacles, whatever this is, what uh, this person is going to offer you, this is uh, the beginning of a new adventure in your life. Now, you have here the sun card, which is wonderful, is beautiful. And also you have the queen of pentacles and king of swords. Well, what a great combination. Because you will take practical steps with the queen of pentacles. You will do what feels right for you. You know very well what you need to do to, to create the life that you want. And with the king of swords here, you will be more respected. You will be more... Uh, um, you know, um, decisive, 
you will get plans, you will be more clear in your mind of what you need to do, what you want, what you don't want. So such a, um, a big change from all the confusion and indecision that uh, you go through right now, all these worries, fears, overthinking everything and how stable and how much light will be in your life um, in the future as you make these changes. Let's see more. Wow, isn't this wonderful? So you have the Prince of Winter. Now the Prince of uh, Winter with the Queen of Pentacles, oh my goodness. The need to act quickly and decisively, sudden unexpected changes. This is a uh, this is the page of swords. Seek out an intellectual uh, intellectual solution to your problem. So definitely, it's a time of taking practical steps now, and you will see in the future how uh, decisive you will be and how. Um, easy you will make decisions that right now uh, feels like a burden and um, it's such a struggle in the future uh, how everything will be more smooth for you and not so um, overwhelming because for some of you this can be of overwhelming situations right situation right now with the king of swords in the future you have the nine of uh, this is the nine of uh, cups and then of summer, which is uh, very straightforward, wishes come true, dreams fulfilled, a magical time of life. So you see, um, everything will go in your favor. Um, as I felt from the beginning with the sun card here, and we end with the uh, wish fulfillment, dreams uh, coming a reality. So everything will work out for you you also have the fish card as you can see another card which shows that uh, you will be abundant that uh, things will change for you um, specifically when it comes to your uh, finances um, with the material things in your life there is abundance there is wealth uh, getting um, getting in a much much better place than where you are at right now and let's see what is your last card here. It is the book. And with the book here, um, it's and with the King of Swords, of course, uh, you will uh, you will maybe learn new things. You will uh, maybe read more. And it it is important for you because this is going to be another another thing that will help you to to improve, to get better, to. Uh, to make your dreams a reality or to reach your goals easier, faster. Um, and, um, you know, not uh, being always, uh, uh, not always struggling with it. Because as I said from the beginning, here is some sort of struggle right now in your life. But in the future, uh, you will be everything will become lighter and easier. You'll be more stable and more decisive. And uh, uh, you will also learn maybe new skills. You will learn new things. Uh, totally uh, turn of, uh, of the situation here. So uh, my dear, uh, so what you need to take from the reading is that... Um, the sun will come up on your street and uh, uh, wishes will come true because you will make the right decisions um, by making out of yourself a priority and not letting others to influence you anyhow. My dear soul, thank you for being here with me. I wish you all the best. May all your wishes come true. Um, I send you all my love and support. And if you enjoyed the reading, don't forget to like, to share, to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it yet. I would love to have you here with me next time when I come up with a new reading. Until then, take care of yourself. Love and light.